Big in Japan, unraveling the phrase. Hello everyone, and welcome to today's English lesson. Today, we're going to explore the intriguing phrase, Big in Japan. Whether you've heard it in a song or come across it online, this phrase has a fascinating background and usage that we'll delve into. So, let's get started and find out why being big in Japan might not mean what you think. At first glance, big in Japan seems straightforward. It suggests that someone or something is popular or successful in the country of Japan. This could refer to a musician who has a large fan base in Japan or a product that sells exceptionally well in the Japanese market. However, there's more to this phrase than meets the eye. Figuratively, big in Japan can be a tongue-in-cheek or ironic statement. It often implies that while the subject is popular in Japan, they may not enjoy the same level of success or recognition in their own country or the rest of the world. The phrase has been used in songs and popular culture, which can sometimes skew its meaning. For instance, in music, being big in Japan might indicate a band that's made it on the international stage but is still waiting to break through at home. It's a nod to the idea that fame and success can be relative and market-specific. In everyday conversation, saying someone is big in Japan could be a playful way to acknowledge their niche success or to highlight the peculiarities of fame. It can be used humorously or to downplay one's achievements in a modest, self-deprecating manner. And there you have it. The phrase, big in Japan, unpacked and explained. It's a quirky expression that captures the whimsical nature of popularity and success. We hope this lesson has been enlightening and that you can now use this phrase with confidence in your English conversations. Thank you for watching. And we look forward to seeing you in our next video.